Experts gathered in European Parliament and called for peace and tranquility as they discussed the grim political situation in Bangladesh due to the ongoing clash between the leading parties which could delay or even derail elections due by January in the country. Recently, the European Parliament passed a resolution in Bangladesh urging the parties to refrain from violence and conduct elections in a peaceful manner. We are struggling to establish a pattern of government in which Bangladeshi people can freely exercise their voting rights to establish a non-party non caretaker government. You know, for the last 20 years, we are practicing non-party caretaker government and, and people are able to exercise their voting rights very peacefully. But this time, our Prime Minister amended the constitution. Uh, the way she amended the constitution, absolutely through a brutal majority. And most of the people, particularly more than 80% people, are not in favor of this. Commenting over the political uncertainty, Bangladesh Information Commissioner Sadika Halim said that international friends are concerned about the current turmoil. The international, uh, the, the friends uh, from Europe, United States and other countries, India, South Asia, yes, they are, they are very concerned about Bangladesh because Bangladesh is prospering. Yeah, despite all the odds, Bangladesh is going ahead and we cannot destroy this because it is the people. People have done it, despite the political problems, despite these two major role of political parties. Pe people are not sitting idle. They want to work, they want to have a better life, they want to have peace. Member of the European Parliament for London for the Conservative Party, Timothy Charles Ayrton Tarnock is pinning hopes on free and fair elections. I am hopeful that there will be uh, a, an election on January the 5th which will be free and fair in which all the parties will participate and whoever wins um, the outcome will be respected internationally.